It's a great cast from the very beginning. Everybody was very open, very um, welcoming, and we just had a really good amount of fun. Billy was a bit of a rascal, and I swear you better not. No! <laughs> no! That was the first love interest for Billy. You, you get to do a lot of things that you would normally be punished for in real life. Jack, it didn't mean anything, okay? Not to either one of us. We were drunk. It, Billy's always getting into trouble or doing something that's not quite conducive to a good brotherly relationship. There are millions of women out there, Billy. You chose to sleep with the one you knew I was in love with. We always come back together and make up, and it's a strong brotherly bond, but um, we do definitely test the, uh, the ties of that relationship. Victoria has literally and figuratively saved Billy's life. Are you okay? Come on. He is completely and utterly aware that his life is infinitely better for having her in it. Victoria pulled Billy out of the gutter. She makes him more of a man. Eric Braden, you know, come on. He's, uh, he's an icon in this medium. What do you want? Well, you said on the phone that you would like to rearrange my face. If that's still the case, go right on ahead. Bring it on. One day, my daughter will see you for who you really are. It's going to be an amazing ride. And I wouldn't want to take it with anyone but you. Was that the third time on the show I got hitched? I believe at this point, um, if I ever do get married in real life, I should have it down. Billy has been with Amber, Chloe, uh, Lily, uh, Mackenzie. Who else was there? There was Chelsea. Now I feel guilty if I'm leaving somebody out. I think there was like a small indiscretion in a loading dock. Um, Victoria, obviously. I'm still missing one. Sharon. Oh, um, um, she's a lawyer. Heather, there we go. Thank you. Uh, Jeannie Cooper, <laughs> that's a wealth of information. And a confidant, you can ask her anything and she will tell you, she will tell you her opinion. Together. Mm -hmm. Mom? This is like a dream for me. We love to play that bit of, you know, a dynamic, you know, you sent me away to school, you don't really love me. I want you to meet your brother, Billy. Dale Goddard's a lot of fun, man. I don't think the family tree has branches on it anymore. I think it just kind of goes straight up and down. The children in Billy's life have grounded him a bit. He's got a sense of uh, responsibility. 40 years is, it, it's an amazing achievement, it, and it's daunting to think that YNR has been in the lives of so many people that many years. It really is a cultural thing. You know, the past five years, I've been able to be a part of that. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Join us for this episode of The Young and the Restless.